Jack does crazy things with wild animals to help protect and study them. Really crazy and maybe dangerous. But Jack is a trained expert. Do not do what Jack does. Seriously, approaching and handling wild animals can be dangerous. Really, just don't do it. I'm in Australia on a mission. Oh my God, wow. To research some of the world's most dangerous animals. Oh, it's coming towards me. Woo! This is a scary, scary snake. In Australia, the smallest creatures can put you in the hospital or worse. Oh, wow. Check it out. Wow, look at this. A big tarantula right there. This is the Queensland whistling tarantula. They make this kind of whistling sound by rubbing their, their fangs together. Oh! Whoa, look at that, rearing up. That is ready to bite. OK. These are one of the biggest spiders out here in Australia. Some people call it the bird-eating spider. And a bite from one of these can cause vomiting for up to eight hours. If I move too quickly, it might go down into the aggressive mode again. Ah. Guys, really be gentle and don't move quick, because the spider will sing its fangs in me. That was a bit of a close encounter with a tarantula. Happy hunting. Now I want to find a venomous snake. These are the snakes that inject a toxin into their prey through their fangs. That toxin is called venom. For my mission, I'm working with a snake scientist, Dr. Bruno Simone, who's collecting venom for his colleagues to use as medicine. I think it's gone. Wait. You saw a bit of movement? Yeah. Whoa! Check this out. Look at that. Wow. Death adder. This snake is unique. It has a big triangular head, but a very small body. The biggest threat for the death adder is the poisonous cane toad. And unlike many snakes that lay eggs, it gives birth to live young. You're getting in the venom cup ready? Yep. We're going to collect the venom from the adult death adder here. What I'm going to do is use my snake hook and get behind the head. Yeah. OK, I've got this snake behind the head. Collecting the venom will help scientists create anti-venom, which is medicine used to save the lives of people who've been bitten by a venomous snake. Ah, oh, wow! Venom is dripping down, so we've got some venom. Mm -hmm. Wow, beautiful. That's enough to kill a few people easily. You can see those fangs there. It makes me extremely, extremely nervous doing this kind of stuff. Bruno, do you think there's enough for a sample there? Yes, yeah, more than enough. Perfect. OK, I'm going to have to carefully take this away. Just slowly. There you go. Ah. Oh, OK, there we are. We've got the venom, but now I've actually probably got the most dangerous part of this procedure. I've got to let go of the head and pull my hand super, super quick, because if it tries to bite me, it's going to be lightning, lightning quick, OK? To get ready for the release. Woo! Beauty. There you go. Well, I think she's done her job for science. You reckon we should just leave her alone? Yep. Perfect. And now we have enough venom to save a few lives. Yes, exactly. Let's go. Join me again to see more of Australia's most incredible animals.